Hello, long time no see. Welcome back to Music is My Boyfriend, the channel where I, Anais, someone who loves music so much they would marry it, reacts to different music related videos and makes other music related content. And I'm going to do a reaction right now and I'm so excited. It's probably going to be my most favorite reaction I think I've ever done um, because this is literally a dream come true. Um, my 90s teen self is going to explode probably seeing this. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so I'm going to be watching uh, the Brotherly Love podcast episode, in case you don't know, um, that is hosted by the three Lawrence brothers, Matt, Andy, and Joe. I'm almost like forgetting everyone because I'm excited. And they're going to have freaking Hanson on there. And I grew up in the 90s. I'm 38. I grew up in the 90s and I love both of them. Both trio of brothers are amazing. And I always thought it'd be so cool for them to just be together like work on something or just be friends or whatever because i feel like they would get along really well and they also can all sing <laughs> so you know if they could record something together that'd be amazing uh, just anything together like me and other 90s girls would like explode of just happiness um it's gonna be yeah so i'm really excited um when they announced this i couldn't believe it was finally happening <laughs> So I'm just so happy and I'm excited. I really feel like Zach and Andy, I feel like they would get along really well. Um, I feel like they would be like besties. So hopefully they are after this. But <laughs> yeah, I might have to take this jacket off later. I might get a little too hot. It's just going to be like too many good looking men and talents in like one room. Like, I don't know if I'll be able to take it. Got brothers on brothers. Brothers galore. Yes. If you like brothers, this is the place to be. It's three on three. <laughs> three on three, baby. <laughs> so guests, Taylor, Isaac, and Zach, everybody, please welcome Hanson. Woo! 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 Look at there this. You go. I, I so just want cool. to point out, in any sport, three on three, I'm very certain you guys would win. I don't know. Uh, I like that's I... We're not We're not athletes, no. No, we're musicians, <laughs> and, and that is sort of like the kryptonite for athleticism. <laughs> exactly. We can jump up and down. We're all good. You know, just, but you guys. I win wish they were together in person, but this is still really awesome. No, no. Well, look, you know, it's really crazy. We were just saying this before we got on with you guys. It's amazing that our paths are not crossed, right? Because we've right? been doing this. This yes. is my forty-third year of doing this, right? right? I know you. I feel like uh, also of our generation, like the Lawrence brothers, the Hanson brothers. Yeah. This is a. This is a thing. It's, it's almost time. like 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 you know, as when you walk into the world, they go, oh, one of the. You, is that yes. an identity that you guys embrace? Obviously, Aww, you I like how Taylor is asking like, them hmm, questions yeah. too. You know, sometimes people he still loves ask this. us. He loves still it. ask us which ones. He the loves one, which it. I kind of like because you know I'm getting old, guys. <laughs> he, getting loves, old guys. he loves it when when he's like they thought I'm the young one. He always wears <laughs> that proudly. I love it. I love it so much. Uh, I just noticed Joey's hats in the back. Time. I'll say yeah. whoa, and I and I think that probably is this is and like he said, sort of forged in fire. This makes me so happy. just seeing them talk to each other. It's oh very God. hard to explain. Because most yeah, bands no, I, don't even make it. They don't even get through, let alone genetic bands. You know what I mean? I mean they, <laughs> genetic forget bands. Forget that. You know, one day people started screaming, whoa, like everywhere. We would go across the streets <laughs> and stuff. And, <laughs> and, <laughs> and that's what, like, whoa, whoa. whoa. We'd be in the that's urinals your, that's and your guys. I'm sorry. Dude, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, seriously. You know, and yeah. I'm, I'm, <laughs> that's I, I can't, Yeah, exactly. Exactly. It's just a staple. And for the time, whoa. it really was that impactful to, you know, multiple generations. Well, to have crushed, your own you know, word. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You know, a word that when everyone says it, they yes. think of one person. Is that's a pretty powerful special kind we of thing? We have no idea what that's like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, exactly. Zoom though. up in conversation. Dude, yeah, they're right. in their car and they almost crash. They go, whoa! Oh my god, that's oh, so I know. good. Whoa. I know. Did, whoa. I know. <laughs> you know like, there you go. There you go. <laughs> like, no, that's it, a thing. It is. Um, man. They need to release a song it's, it's, called it's, "Whoa." They're screaming on Bob while they're about to get into the car. I mean, that's when you hit the gas. It's not a stopping sound. It's a go. It's a going sound. Would you guys like to swap a brother out? Maybe we could trade groups. <laughs> right, we'll, we'll give yeah. you Zach. We'll take <laughs> yeah. You can have. Yeah. You can have. Nice. He seems so nice. Andy, could you, Andy you could step in. Yeah, yeah. We just, Sure. Taylor yeah, can let it. him talk. And he actually does play the drums a little bit. So. I'm not, yeah. I'm not, yeah. Does he? I dabble. He does. I dabble. <laughs> well, you know, we all play, right? I play See, piano Zach and, and Andy would be stuff. Yes. And Andy, obviously, the acting thing is actually kind of took us out of that. It took us away from that. Dang, so it's weird. They could have been a that singing that group. Been our future. I'm kind of envious in that way. I, I, I love touring. I oh. wish we could just go out on tour. Dude, that, that would be the coolest thing ever. That is an interesting difference, is that we have to, like, 
sit on here, tour. Go on write tour. something. Cool. Hansen, you guys ever need an opening act? Yeah, we'll Hansen out. and you know, Orange Brothers juggle. tour. We could blow fire and play a play okay. for you too. Well, you know, you got to be watch what you ask for, guys. Yeah, you know, this, I mean, with this, our brother, powers combined, yeah. we, we could be. Uh, no, I mean, on I think brotherly love tour. Planet, Wait, <laughs> that would sell out <laughs> immediately. I mean, it is true. I think I'm getting warm thinking about it. I didn't have to really pound the pavement. On the t on the subway in Manhattan, like these guys did, I it was more a little yeah. more cushy. Uh, but I'll but tell still, you, but I'll tell you, at least he's still humble, so that's good. Um, yeah, I will definitely, I will take you guys up on that because I no, love. No, we we will. I love, yeah, we we love your music, we love your vibe, and we for years. Uh, I mean, I've well, been following you guys for so long. It's I'm so actually, cool. I always root for the brothers. Yes, always, always, right? So yes. you guys, yeah. and, <laughs> and it took a little while, but it started when I was like eight. Yeah. Wow. No way. Yeah. We grew up listening maybe, to maybe, maybe nine. Maybe nine. Is there <laughs> a recording of what? Uh, <laughs> Boomerang? Oh, Andy's album. so cute. And He's so excited. We came so up excited. listening to doo-wop and early rock and roll, right? So a lot of that stuff was. I love it. I mean, the funny thing about um, bop, but the ram and the ram and the ding dong, like that kind of stuff. And it, they would. Every, it's a direct line <laughs> from, sing together, from please. those guys sing. that. They didn't have it was a cappella, right? It was it was barbershop plus rhythm. Love and that so stuff. Love it. We, yeah. Yes, the word strife is in the first verse of <laughs> Yeah. And, and so it's, you're gonna hear no a lot. A lot. You know? yeah. Yes. And, that's and true. you have to be really good at hearing that and then still mm -hmm. going, okay, that's fine. So next. Yep. You have to be really good. At, you have to be just cocky enough to <laughs> yeah. just be like they have no idea. Yeah. I am <laughs> super duper great. I mean, right? Have you guys had that experience? I mean, obviously you have. Yeah. I can't Gotta keep it pushing. Yep. Just, no. We always say, I don't care how many no's I get. I, I just need one yes. I need mm. one yes. Right. So it's good you wisdom. celebrate that. Fundamentally, <laughs> it's it's that belief that you have something that will help other people, something to provide to people that that will create value. It's not yeah. necessarily that you're the best mm -hmm. or the brightest or the number one this or that, but people will stumble upon this song and that will help them. And that's worthy of working hard to make it right. Right. This will get them through a bad Gotta moment, believe in yourself a, a breakup or a and loss of provide. a family member. Yes. I mean, one of the first times we started doing work in places like South um, Sub-Saharan Africa. So South Africa. I want to talk to. Yes. I want to. You know, yeah. you're, you're oh, working ask with him, these Ask him. Ask him. He's so excited. Through the so most cute. Horrific, what, what really should happen is, is the older brother brings younger brother up. Right. Gives him experiences he wouldn't get. Otherwise, scars he wouldn't get. <laughs> yes, yep. You but got it. Keeps <laughs> the older brother and he's like, and vibrant, yep. full of the joy part, not the adulting part, right? Aww, keeps you so thinking about, dreaming about. Now, I have five kids. Taylor has seven. Isaac has three. We're right? breeders. <laughs> wow. <laughs> One of the coolest experiences I've been having lately face, is the joy of. That is so crazy. I have three daughters. And these two morons have not had any kids yet. None. Morons. So oh, I'm on an what island. What are you guys doing? What are, what are you, come on, start breeding. Let's go. I know. I know. I've go. been. I've been a dad. You're serious, for You're serious dad material. I mean, I'm sure that <laughs> yes. the ladies let you know that. You just are like, no, no. <laughs> these these guys. These, you know, these guys. I, well, I had. I, I guess a series. We, of, I, did I actually just say that? Yeah, I'm you so did. Sorry. Yeah, that was so <laughs> nice. And, I don't even. <laughs> It, oh, believe me. Believe me. So, Andy knows. He's the youngest one getting all of the, wow, I had no idea. Andy is so beautiful. No, he loves it. No, he loves it. No, He's the only, one. It's only because I was I went from like a child to, you know, a, a grown adult. So yeah. it's a big shift. A yeah. That's, that's are you kidding? Andy's well, like, hey, have you, uh, have you read those comments, guys? No, I never <laughs> said that. Those I comments said. are pretty good. No, they go <laughs> out They're of, good no, about you, you no. jerk. They're good about you. Going that. I always get like, does Joey have less hair than he used to have? That's or? not true. You're Joey's the only that says that. <laughs> Joey's a little Joey's leaner. Just, Joey's a little yeah. leaner than I thought he was. It's, I always get no. like, wow, you're so much leaner than no. I like how big do you want me to be? <laughs> I mean, I'm only, you know, I'm yeah. only I'm only like five nine well, and a half. It's a great, not that big of a let guy. Let me tell you, there's a special place for younger brothers because when Aww. you start off really young, Zach like and Andy. Andy and I did. People, they really underestimate you. And then suddenly they're like, wow, he's not a yeah. troll. Exactly. <laughs> I know. Yeah, exactly. I, I like, thought he yeah. used to be like an ankle bite-biter or something, you know. <laughs> like, he's kind of like decent looking and he, he has, has a personality. An actual bridge. <laughs> okay. Okay. Obviously, we're not all gifted or blessed enough to always just meet the woman of our dreams. Um, but... Uh, Sometimes you have to decide. I think the thing that people <laughs> underestimate about that is like the power. Like, think of the bond you have with your brothers, right? 
and you have this incredible lifelong bond of, and that's why you want to find a woman and get bonded because then you get to have that get bonded is, is that with why? a woman. Is that why? <laughs> yes. It was a really different, what do you mean by bonded, a really bro? different experience no. for me. <laughs> the other, I was like, wow, she's really pretty. I see a t-shirt, <laughs> Zach, get bonded. <laughs> I say, listen, get listen bonded. what I'm saying is we uh, started dating when, in, when I was 17. You know, I, th- I think one of the things about all this, it's so interesting. I mean, they're I would have never. <laughs> They're so amazed. Like, I love the Lawrence Bros. Said design. that coming up. Obviously, I don't want to ride life out with someone else. I don't want to let you go. So, yeah. Aww, life begins the next chapter, so and it's cute. been. We all basically Hanson married. Hanson giving Lawrence Brothers yeah. yeah. marriage yes. advice. So, I, I was just they have genuine oh, halos. Wings. I was gonna be like, listen, she's so hot. I was just like, I found the hottest girl, and I was like, she's so hot. I want to get bonded. I thought you were gonna hold (laughs) us in. We're gonna hold it together. I I the brothers need to meet in person. Yes, that's what I've been saying. I want them to meet in person. Break the time space continuum. Can we be there? We should be in LA. So, guys, should be a show. Guys, in LA in the fall. So um, uh, we'll just we'll do some connecting. We'll do guys, some. Guys, give you my numbers, and you'll give me the numbers. People will talk to your people. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, guys, yeah. You, you have to. Yes. Andy, <laughs> yes. Andy, don't don't you don't you ride motorcycles? Yeah, I got. Yeah, you ride <laughs> motorcycles. Uh, Isaac's Zach the does. only one smart enough not to. Yeah. Zach and I do. Um, so I crash See, motorcycles. Zach and Andy, oh. besties. Dude, I know. That's my biggest yeah, fear. Yeah. Yeah. We we do ride, so we should get together and ride. Uh, yeah, man. Yes. I would love to. Guys, if you guys are out here, you need to film fall, it so please. we can watch. Yes, we will gather yeah, 100%. 100%. And I'll tell you, man, Listen. if you ever want to like do a song or something, well, you're gonna, mean, we're, we're going to come to Tulsa. You're going to see us outside of 3CG Records. We're going to stand out there dude, and lay lay outside dude, the building. Dude, until seriously, you guys, we need Hanson and the Lawrence Brothers to to do a like a, yeah. a, a country rock song or something. Oh, yes. okay. so that, that, I would dream. Die. that would be a dream. That would die. be so cool. No, no, no. Guys, we understand. That would be a dream. For real. No, that would be my dream. Really cool. Like that would be let's, unbelievable. Ser- quite seriously, let's just do it. Do it. We're all recorded here. on a motorcycle. Just don't don't need, we don't need any permission from anywhere right. else. I'll be it's riding shape, a Vespa. Yeah, yeah. No, I'll be. Uh, I'm a car guy. <laughs> you and I, you and Isaac can go together. Yeah, you, you Isaac, those, um, what are they called? Golf like, cart. You, you and me, buddy. <laughs> no, you guys are. We're gonna be, be a, just cruising. We'll be like, you guys are such idiots. <laughs> nice. Yeah, yes, having a great beat time. time. It's gonna be a. I think we yeah. can, we could come up with something special as heck. Really, for sure. I think people would love it. For sure. I think people would love it. Great. Yes, we I would really love do it. Do it right now. Do it. Adults. No one can stop us. We do are it. legally. But when it came time for those moments and those drugs were there and that alcohol was there, I literally thought about that and I was like, I don't want to put that in my body. I don't want to do that. And I got off on saying no. I literally found my strength in going, I'm good. No, I'm good. And mm-hmm. I literally never did. Yeah. And, and, it, and it's a testament yes. to our parents because that's Same. exactly what they preach to us. And don't need our mother was crazy mm-hmm. enough. To Drug see free. that talent in me, and she says it at, at, at whatever it was, Do you know, want 18 that in months. My and us, Joe. Oh, and then She Matt, saw that talent in us, Andy, too. But mostly me. And then Andy, <laughs> and then, no, and then, and then she saw it in Matt. It's a shame that, mm-hmm. that that darkness is what's being made cool. Because really, what should be made yeah. cool yeah. is the wholesomeness. Yeah, is when you, because when you, at the end of the day, you 30 kick, years later, yes. when yeah. you have to live with yourself you and the actions jerk, that you have famous. done in your life, mm-hmm. man, you're going to be a and you see it played out over and Good over point. and over again. It's just a shame that Hollywood. You don't have to do this drugs. You don't have to smoke. Versus I don't the smoke wholeness. or have done any drugs. You don't need that. Yes. Well, the, well, actually, what will make you happy in the end yes. of the day? What's cool and is it's what... important that we keep doing that and keep putting that that out into the world because there's and very few healthier. of us that are doing that. Yep. Mm. What's cool is when you kick darkness's ass and you yeah. win. Heck that's, yeah, man. That yeah. is that is what's yeah. really that's, that's Luke Skywalker, it. baby. Yeah. No, <laughs> that's I, a good way to put it. No, I good way to put it. That's on a tantrum. I do think they tried to do to Luke Skywalker. Like, I see it all the time with female artists where they get really manipulated and exploited and overly sexualized because there's a bunch of, for lack of better say, a bunch of old perverts that want them to dress with very little on as opposed mm. to their incredible God-given talent yeah. of their voice, of their Amen, ability dude. to write, of their ability to perform. Yes. That has, that has very little to do with the external reality of who they are and has a lot to do with their internal reality. And in mm-hmm. a way, it tells, it's almost like they're trying to like Brittany, get control Kesha. of the internal reality so they can control you. And I think that's the scariest part that you see. Obviously, people getting exposed for the abuse that they've that they have you know wrought on 
on lovely, genuinely talented people who were young and isolated Amanda? because of their fame and maybe Amanda Bynes. were not lucky enough like you guys were, like we were, to have parents who were willing to dedicate that level of time and energy into their children and say, no, 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 our kids are, are pursuing a career, but it doesn't mean that we stop being their parents. And it doesn't mean that we stop being there with them. We can let them live their lives and, and be Drake's genuine, mom. you know, good versions of Drake's themselves. Drake's mom, but Drake Bell's mom, God's I'm looking sake, at you. Zach is 11 mm-hmm. years old. Yep. Acted, you know, to your to who you are, which is much, much bigger than any of the other stuff. Um, just the idea that we're here to actually make something. And so but, it's not actually, that other stuff is all sort of like side Side note. That's one this reason is what we I don't for, you know, do that's where drugs we're going to have drinks later. Like, that's not it's why we're here. But the but the you know? but it's the manipulators though. I think the reason why the quote unquote uh, kind of bond of family or brothers or or the kind of decency of like saying, well, no, it doesn't mean I'm a prude. It just means I'm not reckless. Dude, right. yeah, man. That's, there's yes. a very big difference. It's like yes. me driving exactly 120 miles an same. hour on I've, my ha, on my I've motorcycle the same or in comments. my car is different than me having a really cool car that can go that fast. What standards do we lift ourselves up to, and, and how, do, how do we see the guys. world? Yeah, uh, guys, you know, can has been open yes for high gentlemen. standards. There, there's a lot no. more there. That's like the, you don't know, like our like high the standards. Tip of the iceberg. Shut it. Go live your low standard life. Mm-hmm. Of actually, probably the hardest thing in the world to be is just a morally upstanding, charitable, loving human. 100%. Right? It's not to be successful. 100%. It's not no, to dude. Be good looking. Yeah. That's not even in your power usually. You're born. The smartest people aren't necessarily given the opportunities to change the world, but they are given the opportunities to change the people around them. That is universally true. Worry about your 20 feet of influence, not yep. the world. Not even yep. worry about, but the reality is yep. the only that's thing That's a good that saying. I've never heard that saying, but that's your good. 20 feet of influence because that is the thing that will multiply 20 in feet much of greater influence. fashion in 100 years. Hey Amen. I, I, couldn't, I could not agree more. That's exactly the sentiment. It is... It is so much harder to be the good husband, to have moral, yeah. to have a moral compass. That is, that is the stuff of strong yeah. men. Be the good yeah, girlfriend. And it's incredible good how much we have lost that right in society here. today. Not only is it not celebrated anymore, it's actually they, it, it actually needs yeah. is people are trying to tear that down. Like Joe? they don't oh, want yeah. the good man. Anymore. Joe, you yeah. know they why? Don't want that. You know yeah. why like the it goes losers back to with this? low standards yeah. incels? It's the same thing. Mm-hmm. We have allowed. The evil forces they, to they try can't to take live that up. light away. We obviously need to just a very large couch. I yeah. know. Yeah. We need to just do this in person. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And Love it. We'll Sounds good. Yes. Guys, 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 guys listen, we, we have to. Have, I want yeah, you guys to meet in person. Yes. A, look, being yes. brothers, being in the yes. industry. Yes. Three hour very, episode. Like, Three hour. Like we went I can't believe it took us this long to find you guys. I mean, yes. honestly, like, I mean seriously, it's but ridiculous. You know, guys, right? I, truly, I truly believe it that everything happens you guys for a reason. Go on tour together. Do a podcast together. And I think it's the beginning of great things. And maybe that's super cheesy and corny, but I feel like that. So listen, guys, we will exchange. And then we'll see you guys. And this is a uh, this is not the end, guys. It's yeah, just we're, uh, we're, the beginning. Let's, let's, you know, yes. let's throw this out. Let's see where this goes. All right, guys, <gasps> for real, yes, for real. Yes. I mean it. Uh, you guys are great. Absolutely. Let's do it. And, More um, Lawrence and Handsome Brothers. Thanks for the invitation. Doing stuff. Oh my together. gosh, yeah. Yeah. you guys, it was it's it's our honor. No, honestly. we were it's, stoked, it's man. Humbling, you guys said yes. So cool, we were like, man. this is good. Yes, and it, and it's 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 proven to be even better than we expected. It's proven to be expected. There will be more. Everybody, stay tuned. Yes. More to come. You need to sing together. Duo group right here. All yes. of these, these, this collaboration all, of brothers. All six it. of us. Yes. All six it. of us, guys. Do all right, listen. It. We will see you guys soon, for real. Yes. All right? And, uh, yes. And, yes. Drug-free God brothers. God bless everybody. Have a good Drug-free Bye-bye. brother hey, trio. Oh, my gosh. That was amazing. I'm so happy that they just loved each other. I mean, I kind of knew they would. I mean, they're awesome. But yeah, it was really cool how they talked about both being a little bit more wholesome. Like, they're not like into like the drugs and all that crazy stuff. And... I can relate because I'm like that too. Drug free, smoke free. And I just like to be a good person. (laughs) So it definitely does feel like lonely sometimes when you're just trying to be a good person. And it feels like there's, I feel like there's like a lack of compassion and consideration in this world. And it's hard to sometimes like still have like a heart because a lot of people like don't have that. So it was really cool to see that. And hopefully they do like a tour or a podcast together just more stuff in person 
that would be really awesome i hope to be there have i met any of them Mm. oh i did a couple walks with hansen i did do that i've seen hansen like 10 times live so yeah but i've never actually like talked to any of them and i have seen matt at a girl meets world uh taping and then i actually saw the younger hansen brother uh mckenzie i saw him at a bar in la let me know what you guys think in the comments what ideas you have for the brothers and i'm so excited for zach and andy to hang out in person and be truly best buds because i feel like they would be best buds and it was really cool to see like the kind of the difference like it was like they had similar parents and like the values and everything and how they were kind of raised but it was also interesting to see the differences in like how hansen has a million kids (laughs) and they're all married and Lawrence brothers just three three kids and only one of them is married um and just kind of seeing like that that conversation that was really funny so who knows maybe this is gonna get like you know matt and andy on the fast track to finding their girls their wives i mean i know matt is with chili so maybe they'll have kids soon i don't know um but yeah let me know what you guys think like this is amazing and i'm so glad this there's gonna be more of this because they should have met a long time ago and it's just great to see just more good celebrities that are just like good people because i do think sometimes like bad behavior is rewarded a lot and i hate that so much because i don't think bad behavior should be rewarded or bad people should be famous my opinion um i think we need more good people more um just people with good hearts out there and show that it's okay to be a good person and be a giving person and you don't have to be a jerk to be famous or successful i'm looking forward to reading your comments and seeing any other lawrence and hansen fans out there if you're um let me know your age if you want you don't have to tell me but um yeah i'm 38 and it's just like being a hansen fan since 97 and then just growing up with the lawrence brothers watching brotherly love like watching them there's movies and you know madam boy meets world joey on blossom it's just i love them and it's just finally happened dream come true like ah, so excited i'm oh, pulling my hair can't wait to see more of what the lawrence and hansen brothers are gonna do i feel like they're really gonna do a lot of good things just seeing we need to like help them be more like popular okay because i'm so tired of seeing i mean they're already pretty famous but outside of like their bubbles i feel like uh, the fans bubbles like i think like i met i'm i've met so many people that like still don't know that hansen makes music you know because they're not being played on like mtv or the radio because they have their independent stuff so it's like we need to elevate them help them be more a little bit more popular so we can just show people you don't have to be an a-hole um you don't have to be into drugs and groupies and everything to like be famous and successful so yeah we need more better influences and i just love how like the lawrence brothers too they're they're just good people you can just tell and need to help these types of people be more popular than some of the other a-holes um out there i'm not gonna name names but there's a lot of them so it just really bothers me that they get more fame and money and people who are um just have better hearts are just kind of like not as well known so i hate that (laughs) we need to change it but yeah i look forward to reading your comments and thank you so much for watching also uh, i follow my social media probably post somewhere around here and in the description below and i will talk to you guys hopefully sooner rather than later